Hello everyone, hope you're doing well, welcome back to a new video. Today I'm showcasing this brand new ATR672 or the opposite maybe, it's better, ATR72600, yeah. And I know I made already a video about this plane but it's not actually the same plane because the other video was about a simply converted ATR, FSX converted I mean. So it was lacking a lot of things, honestly. And even though it wasn't too bad with the flight model, but this, this is actually a community project. It's something new, but it's been around for uh, maybe months, yeah? But I've been monitoring a bit because the first uh, stages were quite buggy and not really accurate especially the flight model I remember I could take off almost vertically and that's not real but yeah so this can be considered as a native uh, Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020 aircraft because it's been developed for this and it's free of course Microsoft announced that um, an ATR is gonna come next year to the simulator and that's gonna be probably 95% accurate actually less uh, but it's gonna be a payword so this is free it's already here you don't have to wait one year for it and since ATRs are great planes and I really really love them I thought I would bring you this video to show you how it is and let's not waste any more time I'll show you inside okay the inside looks something like this it's the interior of a Beechcraft King Air as you can see here which I don't know it could be similar to the ATR not quite but at least we have a fully working cockpit and actually I need to figure out how to make it work because I'm not really familiar with the King Air so I'll see you guys in a bit once I sort everything out okay I managed and this is the startup I just pressed ctrl E I don't want to lie ctrl E was too easy not to do it right now <laughs> So, one engine at a time. It's my first time trying this plane, so I don't know how it's going to be. Let's see. Right now we are in Seattle International, Tacoma, I think, yeah? Identifier Kilo Sierra Echo Alpha and we should be yeah should be fully operative yeah task system okay what do we have here pito heat for sure yeah left and right and ignition so let's find those two must be here Pito heat and it's gone. Oral warning, okay. Oral warning, okay. That was quite spot on, I think. Uh, where's the ignition? All right, let's put the cloche back, the yoke. What do we got here? Propeller 100%, mixer 100%. Okay, we're good to go. I'm just gonna go around the airport for a quick circuit and I'll see you on the runway. Oral warning, okay. Here we are, ready for takeoff. Uh, I just wanted to show you briefly the avionics, it's touch, everything works sort of here you have the map it works just like it would in the Beechcraft so nothing special there but yeah let's take off so parking brake goes off 
And let's put full power. Flaps one as well. Okay. A bit windy, apparently. Let's try to rotate already. No, we're touched down again. Okay. Going up. Gear comes up. But it doesn't look bad, does it? I kind of like it. Okay, flaps up. My frame rate is dying right now. Damn Seattle. Let me go away. Well, it feels quite responsive. There's uh, some glitches on the propellers. You can see they look like uh, spinning pizzas instead of turbo props but I guess it's fine now let's go around the airport and we'll bring it for a landing probably a crash landing but doesn't matter does it? So it's got autopilot as well that I don't know what does because I cannot find a way to set a plan inside I guess from the menu. Okay looks like we can put some flaps and start turning left for our approach. Okay guys, runway is in front of us, we are quite low on the approach, so I'm gonna try to keep it up a bit more, we're going too fast, it's not easy to fly because it's really twitchy and the engines are not really responsive, it's there's still some work to do for sure. Yeah, I'm going really, really fast now. Let's see if I can slow it down. Okay, we look good, just really, really fast. Because it doesn't slow down. Let's see. If I can make it smooth at least. Uh, bouncing. Okay. Oi, it's windy. Let's go full reverse. Yeah. Okay. Let's bring it outside the runway and we can call it a day. Alright guys, so this is it for this video as well. Hope you enjoyed. I just wanted to show you this new project. It's a community project and I believe it's also on GitHub now so you can uh, do some testing of your own, you can help with the project, you can let the developer know what are your changes and I'm sure you can find more information there better than I know for sure. And as usual, link in the description down below to download it yourself and try it out. Really simple, free, unzip the file and drag it into your community folder. And yeah, pretty much that's it. I Hope you enjoyed, once again, if you did, leave a like, if you didn't, a dislike, no problem at all, let me know down in the comments what you think, 
and yeah, I'll see you in the next one.